Hi everyone, welcome to Insights with Lily Zhang. Today is 24th of June. Well, it's officially winter time in Australia, in Melbourne, but as you can see, it's look at the Australian, typical Australian blue sky. And what is that? It's a magnolia. It's a spring flower. It's a beautiful spring flower. See? And uh, look at this mandarin. I think this is a autumn a fruit. So, you can see that's the autumn color. And uh, this is uh, Melbourne, Australia. You know, we are officially in winter time, but uh, you feel like it's spring and autumn. And always Australians, not short of the sunshine and blue sky. Well, today I'm not going to talk about Australians weather. I'm going to talk about, I'm going to bring you to the art center, art prison of Melbourne. Follow me. Hi everyone, this is uh, Lily. Nice to see you again. Now, behind me, uh, today I'm at uh, Melbourne's Art Precinct, the Art Center. Melbourne is the cultural, art, and uh, creative center of Australia. Um, this area behind me is so concentration of art galleries, ballet house, um, and uh, creative centers. This is uh, Melbourne, even Australia's art and entertainment center. So, let's go. Melbourne's art precinct is located uh, very close to, is just uh, right at the south of Melbourne CBD. It's, um, I consider, it's the most beautiful part of Melbourne. It's not just its location, it's also its natural surroundings and, uh, of course, the arty atmosphere. See, here we can see across uh, the other side of the road, that's uh, Melbourne's Botanical Garden and uh, of, uh, Melbourne's Memorial Ground. It's uh, St Kilda Road. So this area actually had a long history established in late 19th centuries. This is the famous uh, NGV, which is um, National Gallery of Victoria. It's very, look at that contemporary beautiful uh, gallery building. Um, NGV is uh, opened in 1968, the total connection has doubled in size to more than 70,000 works of art. It's uh, got connections of European, Asian, South Pacific and uh, Australian art pieces. This is a truly iconic Melbourne building. The gallery has been totally redesigned to house one of the most impressive connections in the Southern Hemisphere. Well, look at that. That's very interesting. Did you see those birds? Um, well, this is obviously um, the latest expression from the NGV, which is called Australian Birds. Well, they are not, uh, you can see they are not real birds. Actually, they are animated uh, LED lights, uh, screens with uh, uh, birds. This project actually is designed by British artist uh, Julia Opie's latest work and uh, together with Melbourne City and NGV. This uh, project has uh, uh, fundamentals of uh, this is just a, a clean visual language of modern life with the fundamentals of art history. It is a work influenced by classical portrait, Egyptian arts and uh, Japanese woodblock prints, as well as public signage. 
information boards and traffic signs. Traffic signs? Well, okay, <laughs> yes, you can see the traffic. Well, um, I I just feel it's it's quite it, it, actually this is a new permanent installation in the public sphere out uh, just in front of the gallery. And um, there are more than twenty LED、uh, screen board with、uh, these birds.、Uh, very interesting. Actually, you can see they just uh, uh, this is an art gallery building and.、Uh, With traffic, and you can see the modern life and those birds. They're almost alive. You see, they're just not interrupted by the traffic, by people. And、um, I think this kind of、uh, installations in front of the art gallery is just、uh, beautiful. Well, this is the entrance of the gallery, and.、Uh, This is the most、uh, famous art piece of the gallery. Also, that's the you can see this is a mirror wall, and with the waterfall falling down of that, this whole piece is an art piece and called、um, Gallery NGV's Water Wall. It's been created in 1984 by art Australian artist Keith Garin. And、uh, he basically just created the whole piece. It's he he draw on the mirror, and basically people can see from outside. This is outside, and when you go inside, you can see the drawings on the mirror too. Well, today, unfortunately, it's it's closed. Coronavirus. I think they're gonna reopen tomorrow. See, everybody love to run their finger through the waters. Beautiful Aboriginal arts. Well, unfortunately, today I can't get in, get inside. The National Gallery of Victoria,、um, founded in 1861, it is Australia's oldest and most visited art museum. NGV is very famous for its、um, uh, grand hall. The Magnificent ceiling is the world's largest stained glass ceiling, designed by Australian artist Leonard French. It is very tall, 13 meters, and with a mass of 900 square meters. It's been built with、uh, steel and colored glass and reflecting all sorts of lights. And the 224 triangles of diamond cut primary colors weigh about 300 kilograms each. So it's been called the Persian carpet of light. Now I come to. The art center of、uh, Melbourne. This is the art center spire.、Uh, does it look like a, a mini Alpha Tower? <laughs> well, this is a、um, complex designed by architect Roy Grant. The master plan for the complex,、um, along with the National Gallery of Victoria, was approved in 1960, and construction began. In 1973, and、uh, this complex opened in stages with Hammer Hall open in 1982 and the theatre building open in 1984.、Uh, it's、uh, located in belong located along the Yarra River and St Kilda Road.、Uh, here it's the Melbourne's、uh, performing art centre. Major companies regular performing here, including Opera Australia, the Australian Ballet, the Melbourne Theatre Company, the production company Victoria Opera, Bell Shakespeare, and Bagara Dance Theatre, and the Melbourne Symphony Orchestra. Art Centre Melbourne also hosts many. Australian and international performances and、uh, production companies, and、uh, here, this Art Centre Melbourne is、uh, listed on the Victorian Heritage Register. 
Well, it's um, a day. You know, I don't have much luck. Oh, this cafe is open, but the art center is not open. And、uh, but actually, today, this week,、um, Melbourne's recorded、um, zero new infection of、uh, coronavirus. So, so this week, are they going to、uh, lift all most of the restrictions? Art center will be open tomorrow. Oh, I might come back tomorrow. <laughs> um. Well, today we can only go out of this、um, uh, complex. Just go for a walk. There are quite a lot of nice restaurants, cafes, and clubs inside and outside. So, well, one more time. This is a very nice.、Uh, Creative and entertainment area. Nice to go for a walk,、um, meeting friends, and、um, oh, look at that! There's some apartments and、uh, sculptures. It's a nice、uh, area to live. And、uh, this hallway, actually, in, on Sundays, there are quite a lot.、Uh, Uh, just a free market. What about artists selling their、um, creative、uh, piece, pieces, works, paintings, and、uh, handmade jewelry, and even some food? Very interesting.、Uh, just a weekend、um, gathering place. So today, well, it's not Sunday, and it's, it's still Cora time. This is the Hamer Hall, Australia's premier multi-level concert venue. Get,、uh, well, it's、uh, the biggest national and international artists、uh, across jazz, rock, pop, multicultural, chamber, classical, cabaret, and contemporary music hall.、Um, Hamer Hall is.、Uh, Opened as Melbourne's Concert Hall on November 6, 1982, and quickly became the premier venue for orchestra performance in Melbourne. It was renamed in 2004 in honor of former Victoria Premier Sir Rupert Hamer. Hamer Hall is the home of、uh, Melbourne Symphony Orchestra and is the preferred. Melbourne performance venue for the Australian Chamber Orchestra. Oh, sorry, <laughs> it's、um, it's not open today, Hamer Hall, so I can't take you inside. We can just、uh, walk outside. Now we are、uh, um, back to Yarra River. This is the south bank of、uh, Yarra River, and today we've been to the art precinct, and this is the art、um, area, art center area, Hamerhall. Now、yeah, I'll fully show you. And this is uh, Melbourne's uh, cultural, creative, entertainment, and. Art center. So Melbourne has a very artistic city. <laughs> yeah, I'm an art lover, and、um, Melbourne's art scene really attract me. Yes, I hope you enjoy、um, my tour、um, to show you around、um, Melbourne's art center, and I hope you enjoy my program. I see you next time. Wish you all the best. Bye bye.